Hello, viewership. Welcome back to Dark Dark World, where today I am going to answer the suddenly very popular question of why did I remove the Terry Hobbs video? Let me start by saying that it will be back. The video will be coming back in a different form, so don't worry too much if you're a big fan of this video and want to come back to it. And also don't rejoice too much, critics and haters, because it'll be back. Uh, but it will be back in a different form. It needs to be fixed, essentially, which brings me to why I brought it down. There were a couple of reasons. Um, chief among those was that when I first released that video, uh, I never intended for it to get as big as it did. It, I mean, as far as my content goes, it's absolutely viral. Far and away, our most downloaded, viewed, listened to content um, across all platforms. So I was not expecting that much of a boom. And not that that should really matter. I should try and do the same sort of level of work no matter what I expect the viewership to be, right? But it was a particular episode where I got impassioned and I said some things that I'm a little uncomfortable with now, especially now that it's just continuing to grow and grow and grow and has so many eyeballs and ears on it. So, yeah, I needed to change it a bit because, and, and I, try, I, I put in some disclaimers and stuff, but I don't think people really read those, for one, and if they do, they don't really take it to heart because it's so much more impactful when you hear me say something on the episode than it is to read a disclaimer about it ahead of time or after the fact. So there were just a couple of statements in there that I'm not comfortable with being out there anymore. So I need to remove those. And then really otherwise, it's just logistical stuff. Um, now that the channel is getting bigger, I need to worry a little bit more about monetization and copyright and stuff like that. And I have some audio clips in this episode that I don't have the rights to. So I need to remove those as well. And that's going to change the scope of the episode a bit, right? Like if you're familiar with the episode, there's that whole catfish island part towards the end. That That's a problem. I don't own the rights to that, that segment with Bob Ruff and Jim Clemente. So I'll have to change up how I approach that part because it is key to the episode. Um, and I'm confident I can do that. Uh, this won't be down for too long. I will be able to get a new updated episode out very soon. And in the meantime, I thought it might be fun to take all of the ridiculous amount of questions and comments that were on that episode in its original form and answer them here, sort of react to some of the comments as uh, just some additional content, some additional videos, because there are some fun ones. We'll put it that way. There are some fun ones that I think would be entertaining for all if I were to react to. So, yeah, that's the plan. We'll do a responding, reacting to the Terry Hobbs comments. And uh, in the meantime, while I'm working on the updated real West Memphis Boogeyman episode, which I intend to have out ASAP, this summer is going to be much easier for me to get out content more consistently. So thank you for bearing with me in these last few months where it hasn't been so consistent. I appreciate you being here. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for liking the videos and for giving me all of your support here at Dark Dark World. That's it for me. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.